hello hello how are you guys so today we are going to be playing with some makeup you guys we are going to try to use mostly huda beauty so i wanted to test out huda beauty and see what this mercury palette is all about you guys like oh my god like i'm dying to dip into here and like really try this like i am so like ready and you guys for eyeshadow primer i'm gonna go ahead and use her concealer and i think i'm in let me see i am in the color granola so this is her concealer and you guys i love huda beauty's concealer it is so bomb and full damn coverage and you guys so while you are watching me right now you guys better put me on pause and go hit that thumbs up and subscribe to my channel because you guys need to show me some love okay you guys subscribe and thumbs up this video do so hello so let's go in with this shade Karma right here. You guys, it's like a really, um, what kind of color? Peachy. It's a really pretty nude peachy shade right here, you guys. And it is in the shade Karma. Right there. Okay. It is very, very pigmented, but I will say it's actually darker in the pan than what I thought. <laughs> it is but it's a pretty shade you guys and you guys this mirror in here is like dope it's super dope like look you guys can see my monitor and everything but I mean yeah it gets dirty quick that's the only thing what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stamp first oh and you guys it does have fallout just FYI I don't mind fallout. I'm just letting you guys know because a lot of you asses like really want to know about the fallout. It does have fallout. And you guys, this palette I think is what, like $67, I believe. Which I think that's very, very pricey for like an eyeshadow palette. Like I really do. I'm getting a little warm, you guys. But she's obviously selling, you know. She's doing really good. But I really do think um, Huda's stuff is actually very, very, very overpriced. I will say that. But then again, you're paying for the name brand, you know, that's what you're paying for. So, I mean, kudos, whatever. It's Fallout, guys, but you guys, it is very pigmented and it really blends out beautiful. Like, it really does. I already kind of know where I'm going to go with this kind of look. Now, I'm going to go ahead and take Hot Mess, which is like that purple kind of shade from the palette right here so I'm gonna go in with this one which is hot mess oh it's a pretty shade it's a pretty shade so now what we're going to do is we're going to cut the crease. We're going to use the same concealer, guys, which is the Huda Beauty Concealer. And then, so now what we're going to do is we're going to take that gold shade, guys. It's this one right here. Oh, it's so pretty you guys it's so it's such like a foily eyeshadow it looks so pigmented as well wow. and this one is in the shade gold glitch oh wow 
Wow, that's so pretty. Angel, why aren't you watching TV? Oh. Has Terry Friend got there yet? Yeah. Alright guys, that looks so beautiful, like it's so pretty. Wow, what? Now what I'm gonna do guys is I'm gonna grab a little bit more of the purple shade, you guys. And we're gonna go ahead and like really just stamp that over and start blending this bitch out because we want her to look seamless. Seam, seamless. And this palette like is really pretty. It's like it blends like a dream, no lie. I mean, it is pricey, don't get me wrong, but shit. $67 for this. She's playing. She's coming for the money. She is. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take this off of balance shade, guys, right here. It's like a lighter muted purple shade. And what we're going to do is we're going to really put that right here on the outer corner just to have like that transition effect. Just like that. I never tried this Huda Beauty liner, you guys. This is her first liquid liner. And you guys, in store, I did swatch it like on my hand and it's super black. Like, I could not believe how dark it is. It's like, color-wise, it's like probably like the best ones I've seen in a long time. But we have to try it on our eyes. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna do a wing so we can fly. Go ahead. Wow, that is black. Wow. And today we're going to go out for like a, a one that goes out. A wing that goes out instead of up. That's not what I was aiming for, but that's what we're going to do. We're ready here. Get over there. Go to the room. Wow, that's so pretty, you guys. And this liner is drying down, so let's give it some time. That is the liner on. Now what I wanna do is take a little bit of concealer and really sharpen that up. You guys already know my trick and what I do. So that is with my wings on and my really big ass lashes on you guys so now i'm gonna go in with my huda beauty foundation in the shade toffee i do need another um shade of this you guys because i 
haven't changed for my summer shade. It's not like that bad. I love this foundation though, no lie. Super full coverage, you guys. That's why I love it. I haven't used it in a while. Just because I've been using like a lot of different other foundations. forgot how like I've really really forgot how full coverage this foundation is like no lie <laughs> now let's go in with our granola concealer you guys I really mainly use this only under my eyes but like literally like that much can't really see that much that is but I'm only gonna use it really right here and it has like a peachy undertone so it's good really good to like cancel out my darkness and what i'm gonna use this for mainly guys is just coverage because i'm gonna go in with another concealer to really brighten up everything and that's what i do so let me go ahead and do that how beautiful this foundation is and how like how flawless it makes me look no lie you guys see how full coverage that is like that is so fucking full coverage like so gorgeous let's go ahead and take our jeffrey concealer you guys because i don't have a lighter shade in the huda beauty but i really really love to really brighten up my face so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put some right here down the bridge of the nose right here you guys, this concealer is mainly only for highlighting. So I always use one concealer for highlighting and one for just concealing and correcting my dark circles. So that's what I'm doing. And for the meanwhile, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to go ahead and cream contour like I always do. You guys already know that I always cream contour my face, like always. It's just... It makes my face look so flattering, you know, you guys. Sorry, I know I say you guys a lot, sorry. I do and it's annoying. Sorry, you guys. <laughs> and nothing's really has changed with like my, my, my like foundation routine, guys. But if you guys do want to see like an updated foundation routine please give my video a thumbs up and i will go ahead and do that wow and we're gonna go ahead and use our huda beauty banana bread um powder you guys this is like one of my favorite favorite freaking um powders and we're gonna go ahead and really blend out this concealer You guys will see what a difference highlighting your face does. Wow, you guys, that looks so pretty. And this one is from Urban Decay. This is the Glide On Pencil in Chaos. It's like a really blue color. Just to add some fun pop of color. But before that, I want to go in with this shade right here. Right here. I want to go ahead and take this shade, which is Super Moon. Super Moon. We're going to apply that in here into the inner pure dark area hola <laughs> oh yeah
And then now we're gonna go ahead and take Mercury, which is that blue shade that I wanna pop on right here. Really wanna pop this shade on. And really, really like amp amplify this look. Put that all under our, our lower lash line, guys. So now I'm gonna go in with my liquid lipstick in the shade Girlfriend from Huda Beauty as well, you guys. Be quiet. So that's pretty much it. For this video, you guys, my eyeshadow came out so beautiful. The look came out so gorgeous. You guys, I forgot why I even stopped using the Huda Beauty foundation. I'm gonna start using it a lot more often now. And then also, you guys already know I love my Huda Beauty powder, my Huda Beauty um, concealer. I've used this shade of lip many, many times, you guys, on my channel. But let's talk about this bad boy right here. You guys, I really do think this palette is gorgeous. Like, I love the foil eyeshadows in this palette, you guys. They are bomb. Like, they're really that good. And I do think this palette is worth it. Um, I will say, though, to be honest, you guys, I do think the palette is overpriced. But just know that you're paying for the name you know like you guys are really just paying for the name um and the quality of the eyeshadows they're there you know what i mean obviously but it's huda beauty she overpriced all of her eyeshadow palettes you're just buying the brand i'm saying because i'm a makeup lover i think that it's amazing and i do think it's worth it for myself but you guys you guys definitely this palette is not like a must have you know what i'm saying this is like a luxury just to have it um, because any Morphe palettes can do kind of the same thing, you guys. The only thing I'll say is that a lot of these shades, um, this palette will not suit all complexions. Otherwise, I do think it's a really, really, really gorgeous palette, you guys. It is so gorgeous. I love it. I really do recommend it. If you guys do have the luxury and you want to go ahead and buy it, go and buy it. It's worth it. It's worth your money, you know what I'm saying? But that's pretty much it for my video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys in my next one.